Every count is important. Every life is important. With just one month away before census, 2020 mailers arrive at households in our area. Sheku An from the Institute for Family Health, that works primarily with the Bronx's Muslim community, was at Lincoln Hospital to learn how to dispel fears and encourage participation. Since we say the Bronx was out of 62 communities, the Bronx was number 62 of 62, so they have to know how important is census. We're really concerned about the undercount that happened in 2010. This Ava Lopez from Crossroad Connections, with federal funding impacting housing, schools, highways, and more at stake, as well as the redistricting of congressional lines based on population. This year's count is critical, as many estimate there's been a population surge since the last census in 2010. We're really committed this year to educating the community um, and to addressing the, the uh, fear uh, that is surrounding Latinx communities in the Bronx and immigrant communities in the Bronx. That means monitoring the response rate early will be key. You see that here in these 2010 numbers provided by the city that shows that by April 7th that year, 48% of New York City households responded compared to 62% nationally. The breakdown by borough is as follows. In the Bronx, 50% responded by April 7th compared to 52 in Staten Island and 54% in New York County. In Queens, that number was 47% and 42% in Brooklyn. This is a play Crossroads will soon be performing around the borough to outline what they feel many are dealing with, even as the Supreme Court voted down the citizen question on the forums. We plan to debunk all these myths about the census and um, just hope we can bring other people to just come out, come out of their homes and actually... Um, fill out the census. Then there are the census workers. Census 2020 is still hiring. And Joseph Aguilar, a program director from Part of the Solution, or POTS, is just one of the many opening their doors to new hires. We had about 30 people apply for jobs. If you're not able to fill out the form mailed to you, there are other options. The most important takeaway here is that census will be mailing out forms between mid-March and April. They'd like the public to fill it out, but if you don't, you can respond by phone or online or actually go to a census office. Here at Lincoln Hospital, Arlene Makoko for BronxNet.